I have to tell you the story of this song. So um, I wrote with this song with two friends of mine, Charlie Steffel and Gene Ellsworth, and Gene is the most pessimistic human on the planet. And uh, I mean, his glass is almost all the way empty all the time. And uh, he, we, we wrote this song and um, it ended up getting cut by a new artist. And um, Gene, we're sitting there and he goes, she probably can't sing. And I'm like, seriously, dude? And he goes, yeah, she probably can't sing. And we get a call and um, her producer called and asked if we wanted to come over and hear. They were gonna put strings on the song. And I was like, yeah, I wanna come here. I mean, it was my only second cut ever that I'd gotten, you know? And, and I was like, yes, I wanna go. So we all get to go over to the studio and go in there. And um, we go in and sit down and the music starts playing. And when her voice comes on, we're all like, oh my gosh. I mean, I, it was just a, a surreal moment for me. And we're walking out of the studio and Jean goes, she's probably ugly as hell. <laughs> and I was like, seriously, dude? I mean, it's a, I mean, really? And uh, so a, about a month later, the Music Row magazine came out and there's an edition of it that shows all the new artists. And Jean, he lived in Pittsburgh and or he still does, but he called from Pittsburgh and he goes, I told you she's ugly as hell. She ain't even pictured in Music Row. <laughs> I was like, seriously, dude? And it turned out it was Leanne Womack, and we all know she ain't ugly as hell, so. <laughs> and she sings like a bird. Uh, but thank y'all so much for having me out here. This has been so fun. If I don't, well, I should I'm sure you've seen me around And I know you've probably heard my name Though we've not been introduced Well, I'm the